When you first go to log into Parent Square, the first thing you will see is that you have to click log in or sign in with Google. If it is the first time that you are logging into Parent Square, when you sign in with Google, it will log you in with your BCSD account and automatically create your Parent Square account for you. On the left hand side at the top of our page, you can see that we have our Parent Square logo, our home button, and you may or may not have an admin button. On the right hand side at the very top, we have an omni bar to search our posts. You have a translation button where if you wanted your page in Spanish or a different language, you would select this. You have a reminders bell. You have a love parent square button, which leads you to something like a Padlet where you can leave a comment about how much you love parent square. You have your help button and then you have your name, which if you click will leave you a drop down to my account and sign out. On the left hand side of our page, you have the header communicate, which has sub pages of posts and messages. Under that you have the header of explore with the sub pages of directory, calendar, photos, videos, files, links, and resource hub. Under that you have participate with the sub pages of groups, signups and RSVPs, and polls. In the middle of your dashboard, you have your thread of posts. This is where you will see any of the posts that are shared with staff and parents. If they're posts that you have created, you will see your posts. If they're posts that parents have created and shared with you, you will see those. If they are posts that staff have created and have shared with all staff, you will also see those posts. Up at the top of this thread, you can see a green button that says new post. And next to that is an arrow that when you click has a drop down with three different selections. You can choose to create a new post, a new poll, or conference signups. To the right of your thread of posts, you have your calendar. You have your signups and RSVPs widget your photos widget, any links that were uploaded or included into your parent square, and any polls that are ongoing. And that is your homepage or your dashboard of parent square.